If you are looking for a place to visit in British Columbia, Canada, definitely give the city of Kimberley a try. The city itself is very cute and has a lot for visitors, especially families. And the surrounding area is loaded with tons of natural sites to explore. In this video, I'll give you a taste of what the city itself has to offer, so stay tuned. We are here in Kimberley, BC, and we're exploring the downtown area, which is pedestrian only, which is pretty cool. This pedestrian area is known as the Platzl and is considered the heart of Kimberley. It has ample parking all around, is wheelchair and stroller accessible, and boasts several awesome eateries and boutique shops. One of the most prominent items in the Plotzel is the yodeling clock. It is the world's largest standing cuckoo clock. And if you put money in it, a Bavarian statue named Happy Hans will emerge and yodel for you. I want to find out what this clock thing does. It says one dollar over there. And he's done. He's like, bye. <laughs> Just around the corner and up the street from the cuckoo clock is a refreshing fountain built right into the road. The kids cooled off by splashing in it, and even a few adults dipped their feet. Refreshing? Don't, yeah, don't actually. And of course you gotta try the food. We ate several meals in this main area of Kimberley. Besides some quick breakfasts in the Platzl and some amazing sushi at Sushi and More in a different Kimberley neighborhood, we ate at a few places along the pedestrian section. Stonefire had incredible flatbread, stone-fired pizza. Giant pizzas for everyone! We're in a pizza booth. The shed had some delicious pub food and barbecue with a little extra flair. Most stores here are closed on Mondays, which is kind of sad because I wanted to go into the olive shop and show you all of the vinaigrettes and olive oils. And there's a hand carved woodcutter guy that makes statuettes and things like that, but he's closed today. It's really unfortunate. While I couldn't get footage of my two favorite stores, I can highlight them here. Be sure to grab a wood carving as a souvenir of your trip and definitely go into OU Oils and Vinegars. I'm actually considering driving back to Kimberley solely for the purpose of restocking the amazing oils I bought there. Classic 80s Care Bear.
my god you guys they still make light bright We spent a lot of our time exploring the area around Kimberly, which I'll show in future videos, so we didn't tackle all of the activities the city had to offer. But you can also go rock climbing at Spirit Rock Climbing located in the Pletzel, or ride the Kimberly Underground Mining Railway. There are many golf courses as well, including Bootleg Gap Golf or Trickle Creek Golf. Have you been to Kimberly, BC? If so, what's your favorite activity? Let me know in the comments below. As always, remember to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and happy travels, everyone.